Hey everyone, just a quick update on my um, automower first experience. Um, as you know, the, the automower was installed at the end of May. And at that point we had uh, two sections plotted out with the boundary wire, um, one all around uh, the larger pine tree to the far right of the yard, and um, another section that was a small circle of hyacinths in the middle of the yard. Now, at that point, if I were smart, I would have had the person who installed the initial boundary wire just go ahead and create the boundaries around the other trees in the yard. But I honestly, I can't complain because most of the hard work was done for me. So, you know, the automower got going and I started noticing that uh, it just kept getting caught on the roots of the smaller pine tree and the apple tree and the birch tree on the left side of the yard. Now, these are all older trees, so they have very tall roots that are very exposed. So I don't really fault the automower on that one. Um, it's just doing its job and we've got old roots that are sticking out. So I decided to uh, try to create some new boundaries around the other trees. Um, unfortunately, I decided to do that on the hottest day of the year so far. So it took a little bit longer than I thought it would. And I think I lost probably five pounds in water that day. Um, so to get started, basically what I did was I, I dug into the starter kit um, of the automower and that only has um, three pigtails. And the pigtails are actually what you use when you need to splice new sections of the boundary wire into the main boundary wire that you've already created. So what I did was, um, you know, I turned off the power to everything and then um, used the pigtails to create the new boundary lines. Um, these pigtails that I used were specific for outdoor use. And these are special because they have this lubricant inside that, that helps it to remain waterproof. So if you decide to use or get pigtails, um, make sure you get the ones that are made for outdoor use. Um, I just found them online and ordered them. I had them shipped overnight so that I could get it done. Um, so now I've got a huge stash for when I extend the boundaries um, later in the year. Um, so far I've been really happy with the automower. Um, the landscaper that mows the other parts of the lawn forgot to mow for about 10 days. So that part of the lawn went to seed while the automower trotted along, keeping things really tidy. Um, you can see in this picture kind of um, what the automower has been doing. It's been keeping things nice and trim. And then um, in the other part of the yard, you can see how um, tall things have gotten. So I've been really happy with it so far. Like I said, um, it's been great. Just goes out and does its thing. It's quiet, um, doesn't disturb anything, so kudos so far.